Now, Graham, I'm joined with Graham as well, our social media influencer and man about town, uh, Graham Craig. <laughs> you've, you've kind of exploded the internet in the last couple of months, haven't you? You've, in particular on, on, on Instagram. Yeah, it just kind of took off and went on May and it's kind of like I said, it's putting up general day-to-day -day things, nights out, weight loss. Yeah, because that's been a big thing for you. You're down a considerable amount of weight. Yeah, since over, I am a heaviest, it was 20 stone 5 and down to 12 stone now. And then I, actually a month ago I was like a little bit lighter, but I kind of, after getting it a bit recently. Adjusting. Yeah, yeah. but uh, a week of lens already, put weight on you. Yeah. Well, so. <laughs> but, 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 like, but you're a tall man, like, you know, yeah. you, you can hold 20 stone, I'm sure, but um, that is a tremendous difference, though, like. It is. You've but like lost I, eight stone? Eight stone, I've ever, like, since I'm 19, I'm 24 now. Uh -huh. and, but, like, I never realised I was 20 stone. That was the thing. I went to, like, a weight loss, the programme that was on when I was living up in Belfast. And I suppose the consultant automatically saw me come in. She pounced on me. Um, she was like, come over here, have a weigh in. And she said, 20 stone, five pounds. And I didn't. I nearly dropped. And like, you don't think you're that big. Because, like, when you're that big, you actually don't weigh yourself. It's only kind of when you... You're on a plan or you're trying to slim down you're actually you have a scales so back then like i wouldn't have had a scales at all were you always chubby in school were you, yeah were you, always yeah, but, like, like yeah. done everything and could never lose the weight always got a quick fix for a while then like quick fixes just didn't work like i worked for like six months and then went back to what i was plus some so like that's how they like like when you think 20 stone like it was like that's how it got to that because but what, like, what was it from eating rubbish or just or? um yeah eating rubbish and then just, just probably that mindset kind of helps as well and so I suppose the older you get you kind of learn and you come into the person that you're meant to be mm. so that kind of helped as well when I was true and honest with the person I'm meant to be that kind of lost weight in itself so that mm. kind of took a stone or two off. So yeah but like 20, 19 years old you said? Yeah 20 Tw stone 5 19 pounds. years old 20 stone. Living in Belfast. And take and five years later you're down 8 stone like that's yeah. a whole person. Yeah. You're like yeah, Emily, you're probably what six and a half, seven stone or something, are you? Yeah, I think I'm seven. <laughs> 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 oh, but you know what? You know what? Yeah. You're a size six, for God's sake! Right? You know you're the perfect shape. Go ahead with that. But like that's your entire body weight. Yeah. Mm. Like, yeah. That, that, I can't believe that you actually carry that weight because you really don't look like you carried. Yeah. That, that amount of weight. I have like, and so one thing if I had known back then when I was eating all that food, like the last, like you don't realize like the damage it's doing to your body. Like, so, like, even though I might look like I carried that weight, like, the, the damage is there that I carried it. Like, you yeah. get left with stretch marks, like, you know, you get, like, you've saggy skin, loose skin from it. So, like, by all means, if I had known back then when I was eating the food that I was, that it was going to lead to that. Mm -hmm. Especially the older you get, like, you can just, you're doing nights out and you're doing things, you kind of, you, you don't think it out when you're young and yeah. you're going to the sweet shop and you're getting your big bags of jellies and... Everything don't, and don't your chicken. Don't talk to me. I have a plan later on today and <laughs> it involves a bag of cheese. <laughs> so, yeah, all the hot chicken rolls can add it up after a while and yeah. the wages and but the chipper. Did you start on one of these kind of, you, you said you went to a kind of a, a weight. I did them all over the years and like they kind of, when you're kind of big, they come to you as well. So like I kind of like went in, there was actually, went to my friend's one that night and that's how I actually realised I was, was the weight I was. And then. So they, you went to a. It's the weight loss one. Yeah, that was that. Yeah. I was only actually meeting a friend there, and then uh -huh. they came running over to me saying, "Oh, hi, you could do it losing weight." So <laughs> thanks very much. Yeah, 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 get on the scales there, and then they tried to sell me a plan straight away. They were like mm -hmm. a monthly direct debit, two hundred pounds a month. I just didn't do it, and then I kind of did gradual things myself. I went from twenty stone to seventeen stone. I was always seventeen stone for like a couple of years, mm -hmm. and then it took me a good while to go from seventeen to fourteen. And then that was always grand. I was kind of always content with being that. And then got in a relationship then. And then she was doing all the cozy nights in. You're getting takeaway and you're getting everything back up to 17. So, and then I was like, shit, what am I going to do now? And then literally they always say you can't start a diet on a, don't start a diet on the weekend, start on a Monday. I woke up on Sunday morning. I was like, this is it, has to change. And I kind of just researched. For me, it was all about like ways of cooking food. But did you do the, the herbal life, the, no. the Cambridge, and, and all like, these? No. Have, have you done those in the past? Done know? them in the past, and they've yeah. been ex like same now. About gyms, do you, do you no, do it? No. no. Yeah. Like no, no. I'm no, still no. paying a gym membership for the last five years, and they ring me every every two months. Yeah, yeah. Actually, it was just really busy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know? No, like for me, I did too. Like I think if I was the way, if I was that way again, 
and I was under pressure that I had like someone asked me to be like a groomsman in six months time they're great take the shakes three a day you lose the weight really good but like if you're 20 something you can't live having three shakes a day because like you've social things like your friends are going to say go to the cinema um so you're eating food there mm -hmm. like them shakes aren't everyday life they're great for like a fixed period of time to lose the weight so Graham can I ask you what did you actually do um, so like, we're throwing out all the plans, yeah, we're so throwing like out everything. all the, the so like watches, the swimming worlds, all these, forget about all if these. If it comes from the ground or it comes from a plant or an animal, I like trying to like just really keep it to that, like white meats, chicken, fish, never, like I kind of came off red meat and I was never, I was always big into red meat, uh, the processed stuff like rashers, sashes, all that kind of stuff naturally. So no, nothing processed? Nothing processed. Okay, so you cook no. all, you cook all the food yourself? Uh, like and that's the biggest thing about it to be kind of dedicated to it is the preparation um mm -hmm. like so you have to do your food shop you have to make sure everything's there you have to kind of make sure the healthy stuff is there for when you get up in the morning for your lunch your dinner or you are gonna be tempted and taken off track yeah but you're you're doing all that and and no sauces no so it's a boring like, imp like is it, it was boring? at the start because right, your body's addicted to salt and sugar it's like for the first month that i w went about this like i was probably a demon to live with because like you're getting sweats, you're getting effort, like your body, oh, really? like it's, it's kind of in some ways like you're kind of like it's some like a, like a li small bit of a drug addiction because you've all the salts, your sugars, your body's so used to and you wake up for like a period of time and your body wants all that kind of stuff and you're like you're not giving it to you, you're giving it a healthier substitute version yeah. of it and your body needs to get used to that. I'm going to ask you one quick question. Yeah. There are plenty of people out there on Instagram and I know you have a tremendous amount of followers. Yeah. But there are people that are out there on Instagram at the moment in Cork, in Dublin, yeah. in London and they're showing off these big buff photographs yeah. of these ultra slim ladies with bodies that are totally yeah. enhanced and the whole lot and then they're charging people 200 quid a month to sing do 20 push-ups and yeah. be like me and, and that doesn't work either. No, no. And I'm, yeah. kind of, I'm very anti that. Um, so I've, like, I do get messages like a lot uh, like these protein bars, these tubs of protein, if you say that you use these, we give you so much. If you sell them, you'll get 30% commission on everything. And you don't do any of that? No, it's not me. And I think if Come I in. did that, my friends would kind of like, be like, that's not me. Everyone knows, I've been honest since I've done this plan, um, the last year. It's like it's taken a year, it hasn't mm -hmm. been a quick fix. And I think everyone... Are you getting married when? In April? Next, yeah, next, no, August next year. August next year. What yeah. date? 10th of August. 10th of August. I'm available. <laughs> and uh, I'm looking forward to actually going to that wedding now, in fairness. Thanks, yeah. for the, thanks for the invitation. You, sure, I might as well all come along. We might as well all go now, sure, you know. You can <laughs> perform. Actually, that'd be very cool. Yeah, you can perform at the wedding.